Our town is just like your town. Schools, family-themed restaurants, lots of cars. There's a bunch of huge churches clustered together trying to blend in with all the family-themed restaurants, because salvation is as easy as chicken wings, I guess. We've got fire stations with signs that tell you when burning season begins and ends. We've got sheriff's offices with signs that tell you to buckle up. We've got a lumber yard with signs that tell you a lot of angry right-wing puns. We've got RV lots, banks, a Walmart, a couple multiplexes. We've got trees. So many trees. Everything here used to be a forest, after all. And yeah, so fine. Our part of town has more than its fair share of trees and less than its fair share of multiplexes. But don't look down on us. It was just as bad here as it was for you when the indie kids were battling the undead in our neck of the woods. Though that was just after I was born, so I only know about that from my Uncle Rick, who doesn't get invited around very much anymore. We had the same amount of heartache when a new round of indie kids exorcised the sorrow from all those soul-eating ghosts eight years later. That was the year they blew up the high school, a heretofore unknown part of the exorcism ritual, I guess. And don't even get me started on when the indie kids fell in love with and then defeated all the vampires a few years back. And his older brother Tamu got mixed up with them and pretty much vanished one day. They haven't seen him since, though he writes the occasional email. Always at night. And we dream the same in my town as you probably do in a city. We yearn the same, wish the same. We're just as screwed up and brave and false and loyal and wrong and right as anyone else. And even if there's no one in my family or my circle of friends who's going to be the chosen one or the beacon of peace or whatever the hell it's going to be next time around, I reckon there are a lot more people like me than there are indie kids with unusual names and capital D destinies. I don't know why I'm being mean here. They're often quite nice, the indie kids, just they've got a clan and they're sticking to it. Me, all I want to do is graduate and have a last summer with my friends and go away to college and more than kiss henna more than once and then get on with finding out about the rest of my life. Don't you?